at this point, I am finding it very hard to stop playing this game. I've been playing this game today for quite a bit of time and I just, I can't stop myself. What's up gamers and friends, welcome back for more good vibes and video games. And we are about to jump right back into God of War. Last episode, I ended it off with one of the most frustrating battles I think I've had in the whole game. I defeated yet another Valkyrie and I found out that I have two more of them to find and destroy. I'm assuming at the very end of that, we're supposed to find and destroy the Queen Valkyrie. I think I need a drinking game for this intro. How many times can we say Valkyrie? Actually, don't do that. Probably not a good idea. Anyway, we're gonna continue with the main quest now that I have finished that last Valkyrie fight. We're gonna keep going with the main quest and then along the way, if I find any more bird ladies. If we find any more, I'll take them out as we go, but we're gonna go, I think, try to find Mimir's second eyeball. Anyway, I'm excited to jump back in. Thank you guys for clicking on today's video. I hope you guys are excited for it. I am. So with all that being said, let's do this. Yes, good riddance. I am out of here. You can't get me to leave this chamber faster. I'm just gonna teleport the heck on out of here. Oh! Defeating a Valkyrie, no matter how frustrating it, it is, it really feels as good as like I, you know, defeating a Souls boss. Feels like you can just go at it for what feels like hours. And it'll make you cry, it'll make you sweat, it might make you pee yourself, but at the very end, you finally get them, and it feels so good. Yes, that's a terrible pity. Don't jump off the edge. Come back! Come back! You ever seen kids on, like, child leashes at, like, Disney World? Very strange. I don't want to have to do that! Just need to, like, meditate, take some deep breaths before going forward. Whew, just need to brush off all the all the vibes from that last fight. Okay. Let's go. I killed him. I killed him. And uh, ooh. Hey guys, question for you. Anyone know where we can find Mimir's other eye? Right. Oh. <laughs> That's <laughs> I'm sorry. As a matter of fact, Odin asked me to. <coughs> he wanted me to build a. <coughs> he showed it to me, you see, and I. <coughs> the coin! Sorry. Will you. Excuse me? Well, that was useless. You know, it was about that same time that Odin came around looking for me to build a statue with some sort of hidden compartment. Now, that not being a weapon and the Aesir being a bunch of pox-speckled cockers, I too saw fit to decline. But I know we got it built just the same. What was the statue? It's that one of Thor out there flashing his sack to the lake. The statue that the serpent ate. Sorry about that. Feeling much better. How are we supposed to look inside the snake? <laughs> inside? <laughs> we better go see what the world serpent has to say about that. <sighs> Listening well, to these I two is going to give me ahead. a six pack. But now would be a good time to make sure your gear is ready for the worst. Anything you need to do, I do it now. Just oh my god. Advice. I need to, first things first, I think I need to go through all of my enchantments, but seriously, listen to them and their dialogue, I'm, I'm starting to get a six pack from laughing so hard. I don't even need to like have a core day because I just play God of War. I'm going to come out with a six, oh, 12, I'm going to come out with Kratos' 12 pack. Okay. I kind of played around with the enchantments. I don't even know. I just kind of went with what I felt is best for my playstyle. We all know I'm not very good <laughs> at parrying or defense, so I try to play more into like my offensive skills and just hacking and slashing. So, you know what? We'll, we'll see. We'll see. As long as it's fun, it's all that matters, right? 
Let's go find his eyeball. Midgard. Have I come across any other Valkyrie doors that I forgot about? More that we have yet to discover. No idea. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Hello again. We are good to go, I believe. I believe. I don't think I have any more. Actually, actually. Once actually, more to the horn. Once more to the horn. Hold on, I do want to make sure that I don't have, like, a axe or any upgrade. Sure, like that. I'm open. Oh, I'm open. Chest armor, waist armor, axe armor. None of that. Mm. Do we need any more resurrection stones? Yes, we do. <laughs> yes, we do. Don't want to forget about that. All right, I think we're good. Let's go. Now, what else do I want to tell you? To the horn. We have to talk to the world serpent again. No. <laughs> oh, <it's Eddie>. <laughs> it's like you called. It might still be in his stomach. Um, and he's open to letting you go into his mouth to look inside. Oh. Ew. Really? By the by, he's not wild about it either. He's like, scrape some of that plaque off my teeth while you're in there, huh? Boat into the so serpent's are mouth. Are really doing this? Letting the serpent swallow us? You do not have to come. Well, I'm not gonna miss this. Ooh, okay. So he brushed his teeth first. Hopefully we come back out the mouth and we don't go all the way if you're picking up what I'm putting down. Poor fish. Sure, this is a good idea? No. No. Not even a little bit. Say ah. Uh... Well, brothers, I've been to many strange places, but this will be a new one. <laughs> yeah. I've never been in a judge belly either. How about you, father? Never one that was not trying to eat me. Maybe we should expect that sort of response at this point. God, Kratos glows in the dark. Mm. Belly of the beast. Funny. I 
I used to dream about getting eaten. Dreams are nothing. I'm not afraid. It just reminded me of a way I used to feel when I was a child. Let's find that statue. Jeff, what did you eat? He's eating trees, leaves. The vegetarian? Oh my. Huh. Smells not as bad as I thought it'd be. Bit like heather ale fermenting. Rather pleasant, actually. You're so weird. <laughs> I see something down there. <sighs> the water kind of burns in here. That is water, isn't it? Hi. Most of it. Most of most of it. <laughs> He's got gold in his digestive juices. How lovely. At least it pays well to be in here. Ooh, I want that. I want that. I want that. Mm-hmm. I wonder if we'll find any Eyes of Odin in here. There's something bright up there. Let's dock here. There's a whole docking station <laughs> in his stomach. Oh, and there's a frog. There's a whole ecosystem too. Oh, lovely. Whoa, over there. Over where? Oh, I see it. Oh no! Um. <laughs> okay. What do we do with that? Does your squirrel oh, work in here? Please walk it off. Walk it off. Learn to block! No! That's what everyone says to me! <laughs> Even the damn squirrel's calling me out, and I and I noticed this while I was waiting for Ratatouille. Sam, even he's throwing the shade. He's saying what we're all thinking. But no, I, I've accepted that I suck at blocking. Okay. Alright, so now I know what to do. Come here. Any idea where Odin hid your eye? No. It's not like I can still see through it. A strange diet. What on earth is that? Is oh 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 my god! That's actually really gross. Yeah. Well, that was easy. Maybe you should stick that in my head for safekeeping. Gently now, gently. Wish Sindri was here to see this. Thank you, brother. You don't miss depth until it's gone. I couldn't imagine not having depth perception. I mean, it's our, mine's already bad. But to not have it at all. Oh, we cannot forget this. of survival. Shortcut. So now we just leave. But 
We have to leave so soon, it was so nice and cozy in here and warm. How's it feel, Mimir? Well, I wouldn't say I'm feeling whole again, but it's a right improvement. The Bifrost is intact. It'll serve. Then we have all we need. Finally, we're going to Yudna. There's no stopping us now. Laddie, have you ever heard the term tempting fate? Fate is another lie told, told by, by the, the gods. gods. Yes, of course. You really are your father's son, you know. Oh! Oh well, I can't. I still can't see. So how do we get back out? We see. Ah! Oh, God. What's going on? Well, that was mildly terrifying. Maybe our presence is upsetting Jormungandr's belly. No. Something is wrong. Oh my god, what if he gets, like, chopped in half? Oh. Yeah, I know what happened. Um, I had a heart attack. That's what happened. Jesus. What's happening to him? Nothing good! Glad that's over. I think is in he getting total... Hit? What is that? We must hurry. Couldn't agree more, brother. I think in total this game has shaved at least 15 years off my life. What is that cord-like structure at the top, though? Hold tight and watch your balance! The board shifting! I'm good at it! We're about to go swimming. Warn us before you puke! Is he dead? Boy? Used to this. Um. What happened to him? Something we did? No. We were too spicy. Else. The dead giant. Why would the serpent leave us here? Look. Holy shit. Freya. We can still trust her. Right? Until we know for certain. Keep her distance. The world serpent. What's happened here? We hoped you would know. You are far from home. I'm looking for my son. The two of you. You helped me see things more clearly. You yeah. do not know where he is then? No. But the woods and fields speak his name. I know he walks here in Midgard. When did you see him last? Long ago. Before you were even born. Oh, we saw him yesterday. Why are you standing so far from me? What's wrong? Something's happened. I had a feeling that hurting the big snake would bring <gasps> two of you out in the open. No! Do you have any idea, any idea at all, what you have cost me? All right, hash out familial problems. My boy. I'm here. Don't run away. Oh, I'm not going anywhere, Mother. This just turned into an episode of Dr. Phil. I know that you're still angry. I know that how you feel hasn't changed, but I, I want you to... How, how I feel? I don't feel. How I feel. <laughs> 
I've spent the last 100 years dreaming of this moment. I've rehearsed everything I ever wanted to say to you, every word, to make you understand exactly what you stole from me. But now, I realize I don't need you to understand anything. I don't need you at all. No, back off, Kratos. This has nothing to do. This path you walk, vengeance. You will find no peace. I know. You. I'll deal with you later. But family first. Family first. That's a great title for this episode. <clears throat> This again? Hell yeah! Hell yeah, dude! That was so good! Ah, oh, son of a... Ow, ow. That was kind of... You might want to turn away, boy. This won't be pretty. I won't let you hurt him. No, boy. Fine. Stop! No! No! How could Atreus. Freya watch that? You're bleeding. Breathe, boy. Breathe! <laughs> Not my blood. <clears throat> what? what? <sighs> I can feel this. <sighs> Everything. Did it break the spell? Oh, no. <laughs> that broke the spell. Vulnerable now? Like Kratos. What's going on? Is Freya trying to kill us? No. Do you hear the wind? We are moving. That arrow. The Thunder Punch. The mistletoe? In the quiver strap, yes. The mistletoe harmed him. Freya said it was wicked. He's more than harmed. The spell is broken. He can be killed. I'm certain of it. It's all coming back now. Now he remembers. Huh, mistletoe the whole time. Did she just reanimate that corpse? She controlling that thing? Yeah. Stay out of it! I can reason with him! No, woman! You cannot! He means to kill you! He's got a lifetime of hatred now, can't so. Stop me! No one can! Where is he? I don't care if he kills me. I will protect him. I will not let him die. Now touch it. This will all be over soon. There! What the heck? You will stop this! Now! I don't think so. Incredible! Ah! Oh, that was kind of cool. Woo, nice. Oh, man. Ow. Oh, my gosh, 
It's been so long since we fought him. Very good. Very nice. Ooh! I feel freezing. Yeah. Now you know what it feels like to wish you had a coat on. Better than I remember. I think you and Frey just need to hug it out, okay? I'm coming for you. Woo! There we go. Balder is what is needed to teach me how to parry again. Ow. No. There we go. Oh, I probably want to go in with the Blaze of Chaos again now. Okay. Let's go, let's go. Yes. Ooh, you dodged that one. Nice job. Woo! Ow. <laughs> nice! Get him, boy! Oh, Sorry, I'm in full focus mode right now. Ah, shoot. Okay. He just, he just coughed up a, a healing crystal. Shit. Need that, I need that, dude. Kratos is gonna need a massage. Dreyas. I'm up here. I'm okay. And I'm doing wonderful. Oh great. Uh, never felt so alive. He's on fire. Crazy, 
you, dude. Ooh, back off, back off, back off. Ah, no, he canceled it. There is so much happening at the same time. Let me take these guys out first, please. Sheep. Boom. There we go. Ow. Does that even hurt him at all? Ow. Now he's throwing a tantrum. <laughs> Sheesh, I know family has their differences sometimes, but that's a bit extreme. Hi, big Kratos. Stay away from my son! You don't have to do this! Oh my god. Please! There has been enough pain! Block. Ah! Whoa. Uh, shut up! Oh, very good. Very good. Oh, <laughs> 
now. He started it. He started it. That's kind of why we're here. I'm sorry, Freya. Oh my god. How is he still alive after that? Do it! Do it! Stop! Please! He's beaten father. Not a threat. Yeah, good, good point. You will not come to us again. You will not touch her. I don't need your protection. Got what you wanted. Yeah. Help yourself. Can you, mother? No matter what, what I do or say, you won't. You won't stop interfering in my life. I was just trying to protect you. I was. I've made mistakes. I know. But you're free now. You have what you want. Try to find forgiveness. We can build something new. No. 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 We can. Because I will never forgive. You still need to pay for the lifetime that you stole from me. I have paid. I have paid. But if that alone will make you whole. Is she gonna... If seeing me dead will make things right. I won't stop. I know. Dear sweet boy! 
Oh my god. Freya. He chose this. Oh shit. I will rain down every agony. Every violation imaginable upon you. I will parade your cold body from every corner of every realm and feed your soul to the vilest filth in hell that is my promise he saved your life he robbed me of everything <laughs> everything You were just an animal. Passing on your cruelty and rage, you will never change. And you do not know me. I know enough. Does he? Whew. Wow. You're throwing that at us. Boy. Listen close. I am from a land called Sparta. I made a deal with a god that cost me my soul. I killed many who were deserving. And many who were not. I killed my father. That was your father in hell. Is this what it is to be a god? Is this what it always ends? Sons killing their mothers? Their fathers? No. We will be the gods we choose to be. Not those who have been. Who I was is not who you be. We must be better. You have a very pissed off mother after you now. Well, I guess we are the bad guys now. In her eyes, yes. But she could never make that choice. We should finish this journey while I still have strength. I don't understand. I know saving her was the right thing. But she seemed all evil at the end. Not evil. You killed her son, lad. Her son. The death of a child is not something a parent gets over easily. But he was gonna kill her. She would have died to see him live. Only a parrot can understand. So you'd let me kill you? If it meant you would live. Yes. Oh Look, my God. there was no easy choice. For anybody, brother. But I think we can all agree you did the right thing. The world's a better place with Freya in it. Just give her time, lads. She'll come around. Back to Tears Temple then. One last time. Um. Yachtenheim awaits. I think I now have a subtle idea of what God of War Ragnarok so might be about. Odin must have convinced him that following you to Jotunheim would bring his cure. Lies, I'm sure. Why did Mistletoe break the spell? She is Ragnarok. Your magic isn't is she? powerful, but its rules are slippery and elusive. I'm sure it makes sense if you're a witch. Oh, but it's also bloody tragic. Balder was the greatest gift Odin granted Freya. The one thing she treasured from their marriage. She only hoped to spare him pain and spare herself loss. But such impulses can lead good parents to make terribly stupid decisions. I don't even know what to say after that. That whole part just let me left me completely and utterly never speechless. Never told me what happened to Stone Mason's son. Bring to our son of Thamur. 
After completing his father's masterwork, the Great Wall of Jotunheim, he thought of nothing but making the Aesir pay for their crimes against the giants. Once he longed to fight Thor, but tragedy had brought wisdom to Hrinthor and cunning. He observed that Asgard's walls were half-built and shoddy, for no Aesir god could be bothered with such tiresome labor. So Hrinthor adopted the guise of an ordinary man and made the Aesir an offer. He would build them majestic new walls, and if he couldn't build them within two turns of the season, they would owe him nothing for his labours. And if he succeeded, he asked only for an audience with the goddess Freya. Odin agreed, knowing the task was impossible, but intrigued by the stranger. Arimthur made short work of it, of course. He had the benefit of his father's training and the aid of a magical stallion for fetching stones. Odin was not happy to find himself on the losing end of the wager, but he seemed to uphold his end of the bargain. Freya was sent to meet the mason, and to her surprise, he wanted only to whisper something in her ear. That being done, he made his way out of Asgard, and when he found Thor awaiting him at the gates of Midgard, he knew he had been double-crossed. But he didn't care, because his plan was complete. It was? What did he say to Freya? Only she could say for certain, but I've had many moons to work it out. Harimthur knew that Freya loathed the Aesir, despite her marriage to Odin, and I believe he gave her the secret to Asgard's defences. Some weakness he may have built in, structural or magical, which I expect will be exploited come Ragnarok when Surtur arrives to burn Asgard to ash, if not sooner. Oh my god, I can't wait to play Ragnarok. I don't often like to play brand new releases on my channel because I'll be like one of hundreds of other people that will be broadcasting it to the channel, but I have not been so excited for a sequel game ever, ever. But since we are kind of hinting at a potential weakness to get to like Asgard, and Asgard is something that we can get to um, in the in the room, in the room of realms, you know, the travel room. I wonder if we'll ever be able to get to it in this game. I mean, why have the gate to it if we can't actually go? Her monologue was so intense. It was so powerful. And I think that's the best scene. Better than any, like, movie scene I've ever seen. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I feel like I should go here. Is there right, anything we can upgrade? Say, anything at all? No. Another time. Yes, another time. Here we go! Giants. Well, if things work according to plan, <clears throat> go ahead and lock in Jotunheim and we'll be on our way. Lock in Jotunheim. How much, how much farther do we have left? Realm unavailable. So, no, it's Nilfheim. Don't tell me it was right next to it. It was right next to it. There we go. Boy, go ahead. Get ready. Oh, right. Got him. Let's oh, hope this doesn't right. cause you to explode or anything. Oh, hadn't considered that. Maybe we should talk about this a bit more. Nah, I'm sure no. it'll be fine. Ready. Oh, that's unpleasant! <laughs> now, boy! my own Mimir keychain. 
A word, please, before we continue. Is this it? Listen, the last thing you two need up there is a decomposing heat ruin in the moment. Why don't I wait for you here? This is between you and the boy. True. But if someone were to fight... My lady sifts soft, perfect sloshers. You done did it. Sorry. Is this we it? We had to see this. Oh, no. No, 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 no. no, no. no. Fine, damn it. Fine. Watch the head till we return. I can do this. No, no, I can't. Oh. Okay. Ready. Come. I love the appreciation that I have for games now. It's just so much different than it used to be when I was a kid. They didn't quite hit me so hard. Look! We're on the giant's fingers! I can see the highest peak ahead! Right over there! We did it. We did. What are you doing? Nothing more to hide. Can we go now? We're so close. Boy. I didn't even bring tissues. Oh, I was I was not prepared for that. Oh, he's gonna let her he's gonna let him carry her ashes. Carry her. It's nothing. I just thought I'd hear voices by now. Look how far they've come in their own relationship, too. Hello? Anybody here? Looks deserted. What is this place? They must have all come through here when they left Midgard. What was left of them. of all these faces. What if this is all the giants that got out of Midgard alive? Not really many at all. A handful of them? What? Six, seven, eight? Uh, I don't even know. Seven? Maybe more? Odin and Thor ruining everything for everybody. <laughs> One. 
Midgard was a Midgard was a dream of what could be if we shared col uh, and collaborated. Jotnar, Aesir, Vanir, Elf, Dwarf, and mortals. Most of all, it was beautiful. But not everyone is capable of sharing. Some believe anything uncontrolled is savage and threatening, and so we were mocked and tricked and used and slaughtered. Odin and his tribe were barred from our realm, but it was not enough. The wrath of Thor and his terrible hammer have thinned our number in Midgard to the brink of ruin. There is no option but to withdraw while yet any live to do while yet any live to do so. Odin and Thor would have killed all the giants if they could, and they got away with everything. Oh my god. Where are they now? The giants came back home so they could survive. But I'm not sure they did. Survive? Huh. Who's the guardian? Okay. Oh. We foresee Midgard's fate overrun a second hell. Neither Odin nor his dead may reach Jotunheim. The ways must be shut. The serpent and the guardian remained. They alone shall keep our hope. When doom befalls the indestructible, only then shall the guardian return. Until then, we await a better world. One without fear, without greed, without war. We wait for deliverance and justice. We wait for a champion. We will wait for a word that gods grow good. <laughs> So, it sounds like Kratos is not the only one that had issues with many gods. I should the feel giants. It, but I don't. This place is dead. What happened to them? Why'd mom send us here? One question is answered and two more take its place. Huh. arguing with a bunch of giants. She knew giants? That's us. The first time we met the world serpent. But how? And our fight with Balder. This was already planned laid out? Happened. They knew everything that was going to happen. The dragon in the mountain. The stone mason. All these drawings. This is How? our story. No. This is your story. But... What does it all mean? That I was not the only parent with secrets. You didn't know. She was a giant. He's half god and half giant? A giant. As if his head wasn't big enough already before. <laughs> Why didn't she tell us? She sent us here knowing we would find this. Because she knew right. you'd get there. Why not just tell us the truth? Her mother would have had good reasons. Maybe she couldn't. Balder was never sent to find me. He was tracking her all along, not knowing she was only ashes. If what? she had a plan for us, I trust it. Whatever it is. Besides, she hasn't been wrong yet. Come on. We're so close to the end now. Why 
would he be yes. looking for Balder be looking for her? Yes, we are. God. We're just going to leave it at that. Huh. Look. It's Mother's. She was here. She saw every step we took before we took it. Like she was always with us. Watching over us. Leading us home. Let's finish it. Gosh. I don't even have words for that. <laughs> she was leading us the whole time. Nice. That is so creepy. That arm just sticking up straight. Oh my god, they're all dead. Time the music so perfectly. There's nothing for us here. Come. So, I get that mother was a giant, which makes me part giant and part god. Whoa! In part mortal. <laughs> In part. <Right. laughs> I guess there's just one thing I don't understand. My name on the wall. Giants called me Loki. Loki. That's the name your mother wanted for you when you were born. She must have called you that to her people. But why? A question for another day. Let us go home. What the? discussion for another day. No, I'd love to have this discussion right now. I hope that gets talked about more in the next game. Guess it all makes sense now. 
because Are WTF. You with Rakan? But did she know it was gonna be like this here? Is this what she wanted us to see? Did she want us to tell the people or keep it a secret? I do not know. So what should we do? I trust you to decide that. Oh. He's not Marvel's Loki, like brother of Thor in in the Marvel universe. But he's the god Loki. And this is the best way of doing the ending credits I could have ever I could have ever seen. Do we have to go back? So why'd you want to name me Atreus? I know it can't be for a god. <laughs> no. He was a soldier. A Spartan. A great warrior? All Spartans are great warriors. We train from birth. Our lives were discipline, duty, battle, and death. Life was grim, and we greeted it grimly. Hmm. But Atreus of Sparta was unlike the rest of us. Oh. He wore a smile even in the worst of times. He was happy. He inspired us to hope that though we were machines of war, yet there was humanity in us. Goodness. When the day came for him to lay down his life in battle, he did. His sacrifice saved countless others and turned the tide in our favor. I carried him home on his shield and buried him with all the honors of Spartan custom. His memory was a comfort in dark times. Wow, you actually told a good story. <laughs> I mean, you missed it. Wow. <laughs> Oh, the reason for why he's named Atreus, though, is so beautiful. This is the most... One of the most beautiful games. Visually, storytelling-wise. The team behind this game, you need a raise. Tell them I said that. Me. I understand if you want to go home. This I nobody there's said that. There's out there that could be set free. Some other help people. Maybe helping people was part of why mom sent us out here, too. I mean, what would Atreus of Sparta do? And what would Loki do? <laughs> huh. That's a weird name. I'm glad we went with yours. I Loki. Love it. <laughs> oh my god. I don't think we're done, though, are we? We're not done. We're not done. We can't be done. Am I glad to see you? They left him on the floor. Charm. What happened, Mimir? They took an uncomfortable number of measurements and then proceeded to bicker about the weather. <laughs> Where do you want us to take you? How about the warm confines of anywhere bloody else? <laughs> oh my god. Explore with the trays. Continue exploring. Con uh, complete dwarven favors. Free dragons. Travel to Muspelheim and Nilfheim. Or Niflheim. Find new items in the shop to get powerful equipment that will allow you to defeat all the legendary corrupted Valkyries. Wait. Find new items in the shop to get <gasps> Oh, is there more stuff now? So that's awesome. We still get to explore Valkyries Revealed location. Oh, yes! Oh, my God. Wait, what? Where are they? Where? 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 Oh, uh, hold, hold up. Hold up. Um... So that's us. We're in Jotunheim. But where are the... I want to just see where the Valkyries are. Valkyrie is in Niflheim. Did I miss that? I must have missed that Valkyrie. We killed the Valkyrie in Muspelheim, yes. Helheim. Oh, I remember there was a section of Helheim that we couldn't get to because we didn't have the boy on us at the time. Hmm. We got this Valkyrie, and then we got, I think, all the Valkyries in Midgard, according to the map legend. So, that might be a challenge for the maybe final episode of God of War. I'm not going to lie to you, entering today's episode, I was not expecting to finish the main story 
and I was definitely not emotionally prepared. Was not even prepared with any tissues. I had I have no box of tissues here, which was a huge mistake. I don't know why I just don't keep a permanent box of tissues in my freaking office. That has to be visually one of the most gorgeous games. Storytelling wise, again, like I said, beautiful, beautiful game. The whole ending stretch. I thought Freya's monologue after watching her son die was so like just shook me to my core. This makes me so excited for Ragnarok. I cannot wait to play that game. No matter what platform I play it on, whether it's a PlayStation 4 or if I'm able to get a PlayStation 5 and get it for the PlayStation 5. Either way, I will be so incredibly happy to play that game. And then we will get to see Atreus continue on his story as Loki, as the part god, part giant, part mortal boy. This is just so good. It kind of feels like just yesterday we started this. And to tell you the honest to god truth, I, I had picked this game up a couple times and tried to play it, but I tried to play it back when I was a streamer. I know! When I played games as a streamer, I was very good at not finishing things and not really hanging on to every word, every scene, and really seeing the beauty of all of it together. So I think with all that being said, even though I was able to play it a couple times but never fully finish it, I'm honestly glad that I never finished it because being able to record it, share it, and be, be able to sit down and give it 110% of my focus, this meant so much more to me than kind of just passively playing it the first time. This game's definitely going into my top 10 favorites, and I could definitely see myself playing this again when I just need a really good story and a little bit of exploration and a decent challenge. This game, with all of its storytelling and everything else with it, it was definitely a challenge. It provided such a satisfactory challenge with the Valkyries and the different levels of enemies and the different types of enemies and it really did a good job of never making you feel completely secure with everything you've learned. Like once you kind of learned something or mastered a weapon then they threw some new element at you so there was no moment in this game where you could get bored. As far as like an overall general review of this game goes, I don't think I have a single negative thing to say about it. The only thing maybe is just the amount of, the disgusting amount of time I spent trying to kill so many of those damn Valkyries. But I definitely want to continue this. I don't think this will be the final episode for God of War. So don't worry, I do want to go back, try to finish all of Valkyries, go to the Hall of Valkyries, whatever that final places that I have to go to after I've defeated all of them in the world. I know there's probably so much that I didn't fully complete in this game, but as far as completionist stuff goes, I will be more than happy to at least finish all of the Valkyries because there are some other things in the game. Like we got all of the the giant build the those like closet things with the giant murals and all of that lore. There was 11 of those. We got so close to getting all of the Eyes of Odin and maybe going back through more of these and we're trying to find some of the Valkyries still. Thank you guys so much for watching this all the way through to the very end of the story. It's right up there with The Last of Us and Red Dead Redemption 2, which I've been playing alongside this. I've been so spoiled with games right now even though there hasn't really been anything new that's come out recently that's caught my attention, being able to go back and play games that have been out for so long, I have been disgustingly spoiled over the past couple months. Before I continue to ramble about how much I love this game and I don't want your ears to fall off, I do apologize. I'm definitely gonna end it here. Thank you guys again so much for watching this. And now I really cannot wait to get my hands on God of War Ragnarok and I will definitely be playing it here on the channel. Don't know if I'll be able to get my hands on it day one of release, but I'm okay with waiting because that game is not gonna go anywhere when it does release. It'll always be there waiting for me to play it, but definitely look forward to a God of War Ragnarok playthrough on this channel. And if you're looking forward to that, make sure to like, subscribe, and click that bell button when I start uploading those videos. I'm not ready to part with this game, but that doesn't mean I can't ever play this again. I have to focus on the fact that my backlog is already so large. I'll revisit this when I've gotten through 
everything else that I've ever wanted to play. Thank you guys again so much for watching. I appreciate you more than you know. Have a great rest of your day, and I'll see you guys next time.